everybody. Um, so I decided I'm going to do September. What is going on on September here? Uh, I figured I would go ahead and do um, September favorites. And really for me, it's kind of just what I have, what products I have been using, what products I've kind of um, discovered. And... much I've had everything through the month of September except for one product and I've just really liked it. So first I'll start with makeup. Um, this is the Estee Lauder Double Double Wear Light Stay in Place Makeup as SPF 10 in it and mine is in is in intensity 2.0. And I got this in a demonstration kit. It came with a couple other things. One of the other things I will show you. And then it came with like an instructional DVD of how to apply your makeup and make it flawless and really pretty. So I don't think, I don't know if this is full size or not. But I think it's full size. I think the spotlight is in full size. I don't know. But yeah, it's double wear light. So it's a foundation, but it's a little bit lighter foundation. So it's not going to be... It's not full coverage. To me, this is more every day. Um, today, I just have concealer on and powder. The, stain, uh, the double wear powder from Estee Lauder and the double wear uh, concealer for my face. So I don't have like full coverage right now. Um, but I really like it for every day. So I feel like putting this on. The next thing, I love this because... It's funny, I'm telling you I love it, but I don't have it on today, which is really dumb. Um, I was kind of in a rush today, so. This is Spotlight Skin Tone uh, Perfector. I say letter, and it's really pretty. Um, it's like an iridescent uh, lotion kind of moisturizer. I have put this on and not had moisturizer on, and I like it better because I tend to get oily skin, so if I have moisturizer on my face, and this, and foundation, and powder, it gets a little crazy. So, I mean, you can't really tell, but that's, it's like a cream, and then, now we all tell on here, but it smooths in, goes in, and, like on my hand, I can tell it's like iridescent, it's really pretty, and it smells nice too, that's one of the big things, if something smells, like, my makeup or my moisturizer or whatever I have to put on my face or I put on my face, it needs to smell good or else I'm like, what's the use? Like this stinks, but it has like a funky smell. And it's like, what's the use? So basically, it evens your skin tone out a little bit and it gives it like a pretty um, sheen look. Like it's um, glowing is the word. I've liked it. I have worn it. Um, just it with a little bit of powder, a little bit of powder just to mat it down a little bit, and I really like that a lot because it's more of a natural look, an everyday natural look. So, the spotlight, spotlight skin tone perfector. Next thing, this has been in my favorites probably every time, if not, um, it's the Double Wear from Estee Lauder Stay in Place Eye Pencil. And the color I have is 01 Onyx. This eyeliner stays in place. <laughs> that is for sure. Um, when we had when we went to the uh, khaki chief ball the other night, last week, last Friday, I was bad and I slept in my makeup like a bad girl. And I woke up the next morning and I still had, it looked like I had just applied it. Because I, I did eyeliner right here and then down here and it stayed which is bad you're not supposed to sleep in your makeup I was just so tired and I just fell asleep and I woke up and it still looked pretty like it still looked all pretty and nice and like like I could just go to the store or something it's funny I highly recommend this eyeliner it's the Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay in Place Pencil highly recommend it it is a little pricey, but to me it's worth it. Makeup is worth it. So, this is fun. Next thing 
Maybelline. This um, came out in the summer. It's limited limited edition from Maybelline. It's color sensational something. And it's the limited edition one. This one's in pink 100, pink lollipop. And I got it at Ulta. And I just love it. I love the coolness of it. Like, it's so neat. It's clear. It smells good. It smells like a lollipop. I love the color that you get out of it, too. It's like a pretty pink color. This stays in my purse because it doesn't just feel like a lipstick. Like, if my lips feel dry, I can put it on and it feels, um, like, moisturizing and nice and, um, and it has a little pop color. So, I keep this one in my purse. And it's cute. It's fluorescent pink. Like, so yeah. And the next thing I'll move on to is, um, like, perfume and lotion stuff. The first thing is, um, I have to say, I do work for Bath & Body Works, and Bath & Body Works is part of Limited Brands, and Victoria's Secret is in Limited Brands. Um, I bought these items with my own money, not being, um, uh, goodness gracious, <laughs> I'm not being paid to make the videos, um, these are my own views and my own, own opinions, and so and so. So this first one is a Bath & Body Works product, and it's the seat. Sleep Hand Cream in Lavender Chamomile, and it was half off, so it was only $5, so the only price was 10 and I got it at the outlet that I work at, and it's wonderful, it moisturizes, and it smells really, really good, I keep it right here at the desk, my daughter uses it, my husband uses it, it's like, where's the lotion type thing, you know, all the time, so, I'm like, it's at the desk, where it usually is, and so I like this is lavender chamomile. I like the lavender vanilla and I like the black currant vanilla and then the eucalyptus experiment. And I like the tranquil mint, but I believe tranquil mint is gonna be axed, discontinued. But um so yeah. Smells good too. These next two items I got at my local Navy Exchange. Um Navy Exchange, I feel like I have to kinda of explain this every single time. If you don't want to know what the Navy Exchange is, there's, it's for the Navy, or any military, any military personnel can go in there. It's kind of like a Target and a Macy's have come together and made a child or something, I don't know. It has everywhere from socks to um, electronics to, I get all my coach purses. Um, I got my Ugg boots there because it's discounted and tax free. Um, they have everything. And I smell this perfume and it smells really good. And I bought this there, so it was a little bit cheaper and it was tax free at the Navy Exchange. Because they, they carried Bath and Body Works products, Victoria's Secret products, a um, whole bunch of other stuff too. So I did purchase this at the Navy Exchange. So obviously I don't get a discount. Obviously I don't get any of that. So um, it's the pink, soft and dreamy perfume, and it's really cute too. Yeah, the little ring on the stuff. Oops. Yeah, it's the soft and dreamy. I like it because it smells like cozy. It smells like vanilla and fairy and warm, comfy, like sexy almost too. It smells really really nicely I like it and of course all their perfumes and stuff smell really good and they still has the Victoria's Secret tag the Victoria's Secret tag says 18 and I, it, I bought it at the exchange right here for $14.50 so when I buy stuff at the exchange it kind of equals out to the same price if I use my discount at Victoria's Secret it equals out the same so right now it's Exchange. So I got perfume, and I've been wearing this pretty much every day, so I like it. It's really nice. Next thing I did get the um the matching lotion and the same scent, the coordinating scent. And it's all you know, it's all cute and everything. And what I love about it is it's huge. <laughs> I love that, and it has the pump. I love the pump. So yes, it's originally. $12 if you go to Victoria's Secret. My Navy Exchange, it's $9.95. So a couple dollars difference. Not too much. And it's tax free. So 
look how cool that looks. The next thing is hair products. Um, I don't have my hair down, so you cannot tell at all. But I went and got my hair just an inch cut off. Just, just to make it, you know, you have to get your hair trimmed every once in a while. Just an inch, and then I got highlights. Um, my hair is in a ponytail, and I'm not taking it out because I don't feel like it. <laughs> but I will film a video soon with my hair down and styled and all pretty because she, I went to Master Cuts with the mom, and she did a phenomenal job with the highlights and everything. Yeah, it's really, really pretty. I'm very, very pleased with my hair and how it turned out. And I went ahead and I picked up, while I was there at Master Cuts, I got some, well I got the hairspray too, but I also got this, it's the Paul Mitchell Extra Body Sculpting Foam, awesome stuff. I have very fine, straight hair. Now when I put this in and poof it up, I get a little bit of volume, so it's really nice. And it smells good too. Now the next thing I love, even though it's not really summer anymore, but to me it's been really helping with my hair, make it nice and soft and shiny. Is a Fred uh, Frederick Takai Marine Summer Hair. Yes, it's not summer. Beachcomber Leave In Conditioner. So basically, you wash your hair, you get out of the shower, all that good stuff. Kind of towel dry it a little bit, but don't brush it yet. I take this and I spray it on my hair, and then it makes it easier for me to brush my hair. It's not tangled or anything. And you leave it in your hair and you blow dry it, and it's nice, smooth, and soft, and pretty. And it smells like coconut plus a bonus. I forget how much I paid for it. It might have been like fifteen or twenty dollars. I'm not quite sure because it was a while back, and I've used a fair share of it. I mean, if you can't tell, I've used a good bit. So, I recommend this also too. Um, if you have color treated hair or whatever, even normal, pretty perfect hair, um, I like it because it makes my hair shiny and smooth, and it smells like coconut plus. Nothing too amazing. Oh, I did the crackle nail polish. I got the gold, the china glaze. Gold, and then underneath is Bossa Nova by Essie. So, that's what it looks like. So, I thought it'd be funky today. It'd be cool. I did it last night. all I have to share. Um, if you guys have any questions or anything, um, message me, comment, whichever. You don't have to, it's fine. Yeah. So I will talk to you guys whenever. Hope you guys are having